Hey guys. Hi. We are at Pass Christian, Mississippi. Mm -hmm. We yep. found this on freecampsites.net. Uh, also, if you follow Nomadic Native or camping with the Kellys in the fall on their way to Florida, they both stayed here one night. Uh, it's an awesome spot. As you can see, the coach is right here. And make you six spin around. Right there's the water, the Gulf Coast. The only bad in this whole thing is you're right on 90. 90 comes in off of 10. This is, you're looking eastbound, the way we're pointing. It's a 45 divided highway. And let me back up here. It's about how close you are. Obviously you're not putting the slide out. I probably could have got over a little bit more, but um, it's okay. But this is an awesome, awesome site. If you want a good, even if you just come in here for the day, and don't want to camp here at night. Uh, we've been out on the beach all day. We got here probably about, yeah, 11-ish. And we stayed out here on the beach and Julie was sunning and she, she was on the beach more than I am. I'm not a big beach guy. I can take it or leave it. Uh, I'd much rather be in the woods. But uh, this is nice. It really is. We're, uh, we're actually gonna drop the truck and go eat dinner, leave the coach here. Cops go by probably about every 45, 50 minutes. I've seen a, a law enforcement go by either on a motorcycle or a car. Uh, a couple of people have come by and said hi to us. Yeah. Not because of the channel, they just wanted to say hi, I guess. Say hi. Just friendly down here. Yeah. But uh, it's really nice. It's about 78-ish, uh, yeah, 78. It's really warm. <laughs> That's not bad. It's not hot in the coach. No. But it's as not. you can see, there's a really good breeze going. But across the road, now where Nomadic Native and uh, Jason and Candace stayed, there was houses. I'm at the very beginning of the road for the beach. There's a big, I'm assuming it's like a resort right there. And then it's empty lots. Now where they stayed, was on down about where that curve is. Because if I remember the video right, that pier was in it. I might be wrong. But uh, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Gulf Shores is that way. That that down here you're looking at is past Christian. And then past that is Gulf Shores. And then over here, what that guy call it? I really don't know what he called it, to be honest. <laughs> but uh, this is hey, a really something. nice It's a really nice spot. We've been 700, what did I tell you, seven, 700 some miles since we left Fort Myers. Yeah. Uh, yesterday when we left uh, the boondocking spot, Goose Road. Goose Pasture. Goose Pasture. When we left that, uh, we went 346 and found a Walmart right on 90 here. Uh, about 31 miles east of here actually. Super nice, really quiet. Had a water burger there. We ate dinner there. Water burger. Water burger, and it was water burger. It was water burger. But uh, it's another free spot. And uh, like I said, if you don't, if you don't mind the rocking of the cars, and every once in a while, a big truck will go by. If you don't mind that, I, I don't think anybody's gonna run into us. If I did, I wouldn't, I wouldn't stay here for sure. But the traffic, they say, calms down at night, and. We'll see what happens, but uh, you know we were truck drivers. This isn't a whole lot different than what we did in the big truck. Well, we didn't sleep on the side of the road, but we Not slept on usually. ramps and car traffic was going by. It yeah, it doesn't bother us, I guess. Yeah. But I'm gonna try to get the drone up if the wind calms down a little bit and show you a little bit better. But Willie doesn't like the sand. No. Gus, however, loves the sand. <laughs> Oh, and yeah. it's really, really packed in a lot of places, so there's plenty of room for him to be able to get out and run around and still not you know, get covered in sand. If, if you look, there's a sidewalk that goes all the way. There's another public beach down there. I see another one. And then, of course, the beach. And then the sidewalk all goes that way. You step up and have a... Well, it's like a platform right here. 
Ah. But those are steps all the way down. But there's but there's uh, there's benches you can sit on. There's trash cans here. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a nice beach. The the gentleman. The is really packed hard. The gentleman that uh, come up a little bit ago, he said when Katrina come through, it, it added 21 feet, 21 feet to the depth out there. It 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 took away 21 feet, 21 feet higher. I have trouble with numbers, but when you walk out there, it's like ankle deep, and all of a sudden there's a sharp drop off, but it goes to your knees really quick, and yeah. that's pretty shallow all the way out there. But he said all that sand and just from the ocean sediment, I'm assuming blew in here but this is it guys we are gonna drop that we saw some little kids out there clear to the poles yeah i don't know if i can zoom in but there's a pole way out there and they was they was out there that's probably a third of a mile yeah but we are gonna go get something to eat Try to get the drone up and we're getting out of here in the morning and we're going to head to Natchez, Mississippi.